faint surgical scars around your head, chest, and back. Welcome to the big empty. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we're back. Whoa! Well, I never I said I was smart. I heard the pacification fields kick in. All right, shh. Nobody move. I'll handle this. Be warned, intruder. You are in the presence of a mighty think tank of Big Mountain. What the heck is going on with this dog gun, man? That does look awesome. The infiltrator quest is the best. All right. Why is this? I don't understand why this gun is a... Oh, because it has a dog on the front of it. And also the brain of a dog. I understand now. Okay, fair enough. Now you can kill dogs with dogs? Oh, yeah! Caesar! This is sweet. Oh, I like it. It has the ears on the top of it. I didn't even notice that. Oh, wait. Is someone wearing a hat, boy? What the heck? Small number of bones rattling. I killed another bag of bones earlier like this. Oh, yes! The world is yours! This is the world's greatest weapon in history. Oh, he's like, I've made a huge mistake. You don't want to do this, dog. Yo, dog. What did I tell you mere moments ago? Oh, just when I thought I was out, the game sucks me back in. Does it make them easier to kill if you call them dogs? This is awesome. But I want to kill more organics. I don't even care about looting. I want to kill more, more real people. He's tasted blood and now he wants more. Can you blame me? Oh, where's the robo scorpions that I was supposed to be afraid of? Oh, I should have repaired stuff. That is true. Yo, dude, I just feel bad for these creatures. Why would you even like try to attack me when I have dad strength of this magnitude? Ah! Guess we gotta be careful about that. What do you think is gonna happen when you attack me? I cannot be stopped. Okay. These guys may actually kill me, though. Yo, dog. You are gonna really regret this decision. But so am I. I'm about to die, actually. Oh! Honestly, the enemies at the end of Old World Blues were kind of kicking the crap out of me. So I'm actually, like, a little bit concerned about whether or not I'm actually going to be able to, like, accomplish anything. Wait for the robot moths. I am not excited about the, uh, idea of a robot moth, to be quite honest with you. How many bottle caps do we have? I would like to... Wait, we can just steal it? This whole time I've been ignoring vending machines under the assumption that you have to buy things from them. I am an idiot. And I need oh, to be loved, just like anybody else do. Okay. I've been ignoring vending machines under the assumption that you have to buy things from them, because that's the way it works in a capitalist society, okay? This is the nuclear apocalypse, there is no capitalism. Yo, y'all are crazy, man. There is capitalism. I've been buying stuff from these traveling merchants nonstop. Sync Project Light Switch 01. This looks like, uh, me learning programming. Biggest project I've ever done, rock, scissors, paper, dot, java, dot, jar, dot, oh, why doesn't it extract? Oh god, you only have three stim packs, this is bad. I know. I may have to lie and strat this. I want to side with Mobius! Mobi the way of Mobius is the way of the light! I did nothing! The dog gun did nothing! This is what I meant to use. Oh, I'm so screwed. Okay, we got some work to do. Um, what is going on here? I am dead. I have died. I have faced the great beyond. Um, well, that's just old age right there, man. Okay, I'll tell you what we're gonna do, is we're gonna run. We're gonna run to our bed, and we're gonna be fine. This is the exact plot of Red Barchetta. 
My uncle has a science base that no one knows about. He said it used to be a zoo for robots who are stouts. And on Sundays I elude the Isaac and hop the Bethesda freights. Too far outside my level where the robo scorpies wait. And now we'll beat the machines with his mysterious locomotion abilities. So, oh yeah, check it out, vending machine, baby! Free shit forever! Oh my! Partial functionality restored. That's less than optimal. Oh yeah! Wait a minute, it's not- I'm gonna have sexual intercourse with this light switch? It's not often that I meet a light switch with brains and beauty, I think I'm gonna like it here. Oh, well, that's very sweet of you. Maybe one of these nights we can discuss theorems? Uh, why wait? Slow down there, tiger. Just stay in the- don't go back out there, NL. Oh, my voice is so fucked, man. Don't go back out there yet, it's madness. Just stay in the sink and talk to the light switch for three hours. Alright, um, I should actually, I'm a little scared. Oh my god! Yo, I actually, low like, need you to not do that because you're freaking me the heck out. Daywalker! Night Stalker! Seriously, what the heck just murdered me? I mean, I feel like I'm better off just taking my own shots, not bothering with vats. Seems to go. Oh, 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 oh! What the hell was that, dog? Oh, that's the good stuff. That's the gravy. Oh yeah. Okay. Yo, you are a nothing but a disappointment to me, Vats. What's the point of Vats if I can just aim better myself? Oh, this should be like this is the ultimate Matthew McConaughey and Reign of Fire moment right here. Did you just Oh, thank you, mysterious stranger. I think I missed four ninety-five percent shots there. To be fair, a little bit of the reason that I feel like we're doing worse here is because we've only died like four times throughout the entire game up to this point because I have the game on normal. Okay, now, now we need to have a serious conversation. Done. Cool. Oh, there was a mine directly below me, huh? And apparently my hair is must up. You need 100 in survival so you can eat a dog while killing it? Yo, that's Slander Man. The smash hit horror game. Slander Man. Stealth Suit Mark III added. Hello, it's nice to meet you. Who can I hide you from today? It's freaking me Stimpak out. Stimpak reserves adequate. What's going on through we here? We haven't seen anybody in a while. Maybe the monsters have stealth suits too. That's not something you're supposed to say. That doesn't make me feel any better. Oh no. Oh, it's Dr. Kalis! Kalisi, no. <laughs> Don't forget to collect Dr. Kali's head. Ah, oh, oh. it's impossible to overdose ah, painkillers. What? Ah! Ah! Injecting stim pack. Thank you for this. Thank you for the stim pack. What the heck, yo, suit? You kind of screwed me a little bit there. Ah! Er oh! Oh! What is this nightmare zone? Take Protonic Inversal Axe. You're my best friend forever. Shut up. Broken? Oh, the spacesuit is broken. Sweet. I'll miss you. Ring a ding ding, baby. Three battle brews. Red mist, intelligence minus one, strength plus one, damage resistance plus 35, HP plus 50. Oh, yeah! Time to drink some battle brew! Okay. You have become addicted to Battle Brew! I don't like that very much. Ah! Oh, you are in for a bad time, mister! Oh, Jesus! It's the world's greatest! This is the best day of my life. Oh, God! Thank you, Battle Brew plus Axe. 
Don't think you can sneak up on me just because you have Night Stalker in your name. This is uh, the most satisfying weapon in Fallout history. Oh! Oh, Jesus! Heal! Heal! Yo, these freaking Night Stalkers are no joke, dog. Don't you think a battle brew would taste just great right now? You're a bad influence, mister. Sleep in the bed of your enemies' corpses. Sleep in the bed of your enemies' dreams. Sleep in the bed of your enemies who are 50% dog. The game has no mercy towards canines. Use the stealth suit FFS. The suit is my new co-host. It's true. Oh, I'm encumbered. Tell you what, man, I gotta get some battle brew would be real nice right now, I'll tell you that much. Give the suit lady a name? It's Cassandra, man. Drop the 32 rocket souvenirs? Yo, I would be careful with that kind of language around here. Do I really have 32 rocket souvenirs still? I do not have 32 rocket souvenirs, you, you freaking lucky so-and-so. Drink up the battle brew? We could always drop the egg timer, I think that's part of the problem. You didn't scroll to the bottom, but you do have 32 rocket souvenirs. This is not true, is it? What's it? What's the uh, what's the name for them? Is it actually Rocket Souvenir? Boone must keep his beret, and you must always hold the egg timer. It's true, man. But Boone's beret is a tool that I can use for myself. I don't see these Rocket Souvenirs. How about a good old battle brew? You guys are a bad influence. Too bad. We were spotted by robots. It'd be easy. As long as I don't screw up again. Yo, don't get down on yourself, girl. It's okay. Sweet. Quest completed. But... Also, that seems like... Ah! Oh, what the? No! What the? Jump over it. I know there's mean robot bugs, lady. Cassandra will be a great addition to the dad squad. She's, she's, uh... She's my daughter now. Oh, maybe a subscriber. Dead money is trash made. Thank you very much for the subscription. I'll keep that in mind. Who do you think is cuter? Dr. Klein or Dr. Boros? Dr. Kalesi. Why not sit down and have a nice, uh, cheeky Nando's with an ice cold battle brew? Help, help, help. <laughs> I really wish I took robotics expert right about now. Well, this thing will automatically use Stimpax, right? So I don't need to worry about that too much. Get out of here! Did she just say no more Stimpax? That's a real issue, man. We're out of Stimpax. We're out of Stimpax. Maybe you'd be better off with an auto Yo, dock is there suit. actually an auto dock suit though? Because I could go for that right now. This guy's got a terrible form, I gotta admit. Like, oh, Jesus! Oh, just put it away and run. No, I'm not a Night Stalker! This will keep you on your feet. Mighty this is an issue. Still what? Why was he singing Ain't Seen Nothing Yet? Oh, oh, baby. Oh, yeah, so fuck you. Are they fighting each other or some other kind of like organic creature? That's pretty sweet. Repair your space suit. You are a goddamn genius. Uh, stealth suit is shit. Leave Cassandra alone. Stealth suit will be so sad. Stealth suit is better because of Dad Squad. And now Battle Brew sells for a ton. Yo, do you, uh, what are you talking about? Who's got Battle Brew? I don't have any Battle Brew. I got off that shit ages ago, man. Don't you like me anymore? Sean, I'm sorry, Cassandra. You gotta fly solo for a little bit to truly appreciate the dad squad. It's the truth, man. Now I understand how much value Boone and Rex uh, brought. Where is this remaining enemy? Oh, hello. Military cyber dog. Don't make me do it, man. This is uh, this is a recipe for this one right here. Is that military cyber dog? Is he shooting information at me? Look, I don't want to do this, but this is like, you know, the Chronicles of Riddick right here. Good swing. Great form. That one was a little better. Oh, baby, oh, a, baby subscriber. a subscriber. Baldeg, <laughs> thank you very much for the subscription. Splice, Lobotomite, and Robot. I thought that that would give me a text prompt, not to uh, create a fucking cyber dog. What? Different, awake, alive for the first time ever. 
What is this strange new world around me? Guys. What does it hold in store for a dreamer such as myself? No! What have I done? Let's do it again! Destroy it, mercy kill. What about this one? What? I feel like this has happened before. Nuka Cola truck. Obviously, we'll take that. I know it's not a real truck. It's a souvenir. I got a thing for souvenirs, though. Yeah, like those 32 rocket souvenirs? Those don't exist, man. I was lied to. You really do have 32 rocket souvenirs. Y'all are freaking me out. You should give Cassandra to Boone to be his new wife. Why does that ideal, or why does that idea titillate me so much? I don't know, but it must come true. I fought valiantly to preserve rattlesnake DNA and put it right where it belongs in the husk of another feared predator. Oh, and the tarantula. Can't splice enough, I always say. I'm just gonna let him go. Especially if you can make a magnificent casserole. Yo, dog! Freaking cool it on the conversation. Yes, thank you, chat, for letting me know. This jerk is the dude who invented those freaking moths that scare the crap out of me. There's no way I, I'm not going to wear this, so just prepare yourself. Bolegda! What's this poor guy's problem? Oh, you're making a huge mistake, man. It won't let me pickpocket him. <laughs> you all right, dog? Oh man, you didn't put up any fight at all. Cyber dog, cyber dog. Occasionally lazy cyber dog shoots that thing. Don't know what it does. Maybe degrades my armor. Look out! Here comes the cyber dog. Cyber dog. Is he strong? Listen, bub, honestly, I don't know. Swing my axe if something moves. Doobie doo, doobie doo, -doo. look out. <laughs> Here comes the cyber dog. Cyber dog. What? What the heck did this cyber dog do to me? Heal! I thought these were friendly neighborhood cyber dogs. They're not. Like on those Dark Souls skills? Defragging my hard drive for thrills. Got me a hundred gigabytes of RAM. Never feed trolls and I don't read spam. Installed the T1 line in my house. I'm always at my PC double clicking on my Miz house. Upgrade my system at least twice a day. I'm strictly plug and play. I ain't afraid of Y2K. Down with Bill Gates, I talk, call him money for short. Phone him up at home and I make him do my tech support. Alright, smoking on school property 11. Jeez, sounds like she could use a battle brew. I think if I just run fast enough, or swing my axe fast enough, I'll just murder this dog in two seconds. You found a recalibration file for the sonic emitter. Take it to the jukebox in the sink to Prepare recalibrate the to sonic emitter for new things. Oh, I, again? Come on with your nonsense! Robo scorpions don't scare me anymore, oh, professor. Attack. Robo scorpions don't scare me anymore! Yo, he scared me! Should have eaten the dandy boy apples. It's true, man. And one, as in Yo, I'm busy right now. <laughs> Robo dog, you're gonna get it in the end. Gonna be not man's best friend, more like his worst enemy. Robo dog, animal. You will never get this. You will never get this. Yo, why is this? This thing has no HP, but it's freaking me out. Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh! Oh, jeez! Ah! Ah! Oh, the dog got my leg! How much is that doggy in the window? Angle brackets, bark, bark. The one that uh, used to have a head and now has a, just a weird little uh, throat portal where its head used to be. How much is that doggy in the window? I sure hope that doggy's for sale. Today, the cafeteria will be serving nothing, because I didn't build one. Old World Blues boss is Easy Pete and his dynamite dog. 
It should probably heal, huh? It should probably heal, huh? What are you gonna do when the axe breaks? Freaking repair it? Cause ah, oh, I did it. That is right, I did it. Number five. Are you kidding? Pop open a battle brew. You're a you're a battle influence, man. That's gonna hurt. Probably gonna die here. That'll yeah, that was a good sting. I gotta give him that. Oh, we can do it, guys. I'm the world's greatest. One battle brew wouldn't hurt, would it, NL? Uh, I like it. Travel to the Forbidden Zone Dome. Are you alright, dog? There's two of you. Where's the other one? Well, I'm gonna do it. Um, okay, never mind. You alright, dog? I'm a little bit confused. Oh, good! Like eight Robo Scorpions. Let's quick save here, because I'm pretty concerned about the fact that I'm going to die. Help. Oh, it bounced off the wall because I'm right-handed. Wow. Uh, that did not go well. Eight scorpions, one... Oh, Lord! It's the quick save of my dreams. The dream is real. The dream is no longer real. Oh, my God, they did so much damage. We can do- oh my god! How about I just don't use a gun, I use a run. See you in hell, see you in hell, see you in hell. Oh, there is a long hell-like corridor waiting for you. Open the door to the robo-warfare facility, please. Okay, 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 okay. We made it. Uh, this does not seem better. This seems substantially worse. I'm gonna try to run up the stairs, oh god. I've become addicted to medics. That happened extremely quickly. Um, this might not be the right direction for me to go. Why? I I wanna use my speech stat to talk to him. Oh lord! Okay. Chat, we have a real problem. Dr. Moby is out to get you? Don't call him Dr. Moby, it's a disrespect to bald brothers everywhere. We're going to die here. All right, so I'm learning that probably what we're gonna have to do is go back and get some, um, go back and get some stim packs. Unless there's like an alternate way to, no. to handle this. Maybe we have like enough of a, oh god, enough of like a programming skill or whatever they call it, intelligence, maybe to handle this. Oh, I can't give you anything for that injury. We're out of stim packs. I maybe really be better off with an autodox. Am disliking this uh, creature right now. This this suit. Uh oh. Oh, oh, oh! It's discovered me! It's discovered me! This will only stay for a second. Okay. We gotta get up close. It's the only way I can see this working. Get close! Get close! No, no, heal! Heal! No more stim packs! Battle brew! Quick save! Oh, I didn't hit F5 in time. The dream is real. I think we got it. Now, it's probably going to explode in my face when it dies, but... Oh my god, we did it. Oh! Well, it could have been worse. I reprogrammed their chronometers, geometers, and cartography programs. This is now their world. Here, Big Mountain. It was a merciful lobotomy. They were my friends, but sometimes they would take this guy's a mercy too killing bald bro, too. Uh, if you're done, can oh we again? my god, my let me guy, gotta go, man. Of course, go land your science stations. Go, I am surrounded by children. Oh my lord, okay. Dr. Mobius lobotomized his friends kept them occupied with uh, idle threats to basically prevent them from noticing that they were trapped here in Big Mountain. He thinks he did it mercifully, but, you know, that might be debatable. And now my brain contains some special kind of uniqueness that allowed them to uh, uh, maybe start thinking about a wrinkle that could help them escape. I think I've got it. The think tank can put their brains back in their bodies and then leave here with the technology that they've gained. Okay, the end. We need to get our brain back. This is it? Is this our brain? This appears to- Oh! Give it! 
Oh, well, well, oh, it's my brain. Finally dragged themselves in out of the wasteland. And where have we been? Hmm? Crawling through bits of radioactive muck again? Why does my brain sound like such a pompous dick? Ah, lovely. Figure that out, have we? Would you like a cookie? Would you like a cookie? Uh, what is this voice, man? It's freaking me out. I thought the main character in uh, New Vegas didn't have a voice actor. Um, yeah, why are you such a dick? It's perfect. Well, that's a fine how do you do. Well, certainly there might be some things I miss about being ambulatory. We have seen some Cheeky Breeze. Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. We seem to have a different Here memory of that. One coming back online. Jason Bright and his followers <laughs> launching oh, no. into the vast unknown. Helios, Helios 1 coming, one back, coming online. back online. Jason Bright and his followers. No! It's a bug! It's a bug! My brain is broken! I wanna I wanna be free! Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. I I need to be free! I'm in an infinite loop! Obsidian, you fucked up! Helios One coming back online. Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. Helios One coming back online. Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. Helios One coming back online. Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. Helios One coming back online. Yes! I suppose we convinced him! Goodbye, peaceful, soothing brain jar. Hello, head wounds and scorpions. Confront Dr. Klein at the think tank and end your imprisonment at Big Mountain. Oh, the dream is real. Well, we're finally here and about time too. It's the end of Old World Blues. His pulse gun can fire in spurts. And if it hits, it's gonna hurt. Sneaking gun. Fighting now. What are these things? Oh, we've seen these before. All right, never mind. Dr. Orderly MD PhD DDS. This is a great name. How many of you guys are there and why don't you do any damage to me? If you like shoot coward, you're only going to kill a man. Okay, that is a little bit uncalled for. So you're just a mister. You don't even have a PhD. Um Okay, Fallout New Vegas stopped working once I got that perk, so that's pretty cool. Uh let's let's reload the game here. And I'll check out your rocket souvenirs. Yo, people keep telling me I have 32 rocket souvenirs. I have looked, I disagree, but I might be looking in the wrong category. Do Michael Caine doing gangster rap? Master Wayne, with so much drama in the Gotham City, it's kinda hard being the butler of Bruce Wayne, you see. But I, somehow, some way, keep making up tea and crumpets at regular intervals every single day. Go to Misk and read each item out loud. This is gonna take a long time. Dinky, the T-Rex souvenir. Egg timer, empty syringe. Rocket souvenir 32, you're right. You're correct, I have 32 rocket souvenirs. Finally, he admits to it. Well, it wasn't like I was, uh, you know, I was willfully trying to maintain ignorance. I was just like, maybe people are misremembering. It's been weeks, we did it. The lobotomite returns. Now, your brain. Hand it over. You have the brain, we have the technology. All you must do is surrender. With it, we can finally leave this place. You think I am the lobotomite? No, for my skull houses the brain of Mobius. That is the most insane thing I've ever heard. There's no way such a thing could be accomplished. It's impossible. Nothing is impossible for science! Missiles, lasers, atoms, brainwaves are all at my command! You speak the truth, and the decibel variation in your voice. How did he know? It is Mobius. We could have escaped, seen it all for ourselves, tested it, prodded at it, made it squirm. Uh, I will permit you to do this for me. Partner with you? My foe? My rival? My foremost critic? I have a strange sensation that I would like that. I just, everywhere I go, I just convince people to follow me because I'm the 
baddest motherfucker in the wasteland. You want to mess with this guy? I don't freaking think so. Look at this. He'll moonwalk right on the edge, not even worry about twisting an ankle or anything like that. See you in hell, think tank motherfuckers. Well, there's something out here. We can murder it first. Just see how the lair works over here in the wasteland. Mole rats. That is, uh, today is the greatest day of my life. Oh, uh, please don't kill me. I swear I'll have... Wait, you you don't work for Mr. Bishop, do you? Yeah, I do, and it's time for you to suffer. Please, no. Isaac! Okay, what's this guy's problem? This is not Boone, this is Bruce Isaac. Quest failed, talent pool. So, I don't want to necessarily... Uh, spoil this yet, but I was thinking that when we finish Fallout New Vegas, I might have like a six week window, maybe a little more before Fallout 4 comes out, and I might like to do, like drag the PS4 in here and do Bloodborne on the subscriber stream. Well, I've been through the desert with a boon in his beret, it felt good to be out of ancient sci-fi mountain, and da -da -da -da. that's not a bad idea to hook up a uh, boon with Cassandra. The stealth suit. Maybe they could get along. Do they have unique dialogue? That'd be really cool. You're a little woozy. I've been stung! They stung me! Boone, they stung me! Where's my Boone's at? Boone, where were you on that one, buddy? Oh my lord! Boone. How could you let this happen? Ah! The poison's re-entered my veins. We're good. Oh, okay, no problem. Help. Where am I going? Boone, save me. Thank you, trusty Vault 13. Canteen, I help. Ah! Scorpion Gulch! Ah! <laughs> Ban the bomb. Drop chems, not bombs. Peace. Class of 99 rules. Okay, these guys seem cool. Well, they seem like, uh, like maybe hippies. We can talk to them. Boone does not seem like the pro-hippie type. So maybe I could give him something. If I give him a halo, he should uh, be Finally. a little bit more open to it, I think. They'll, they'll be like, oh my god, who are these creatures who have come from the future to save us? Oh my god, it's perfect. There are two bunkers, this is the wrong bunker. I'm starting to realize this. Psych, that's the wrong bunker! <laughs> I went to an anti-war protest. Here's the bunker. Psych! That's the wrong- oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. They're friendly. They're friendly. It just scared me. I thought the intercom would not have anything. Hello. Hi. Listen very closely and do as I say. Your life depends on it. Strip off your clothes and equipment or face summary execution. Will you comply? I will comply. Take it all off and hand it Just remember what happened to Caesar when he took our shit. The door at the rear of the chamber. They, they left Boone with his halo and armor, but I had to get in my underwear? It's a little bit overkill as far as a desk is concerned, right? Like, L-shaped desk, yes, U-shaped desk, come on. How did you find us, stranger? Thought you'd sneak up on me, you filthy powder ganger? Whoa, this guy has a problem. Keep pointing that gun at me and I'll stick it up your ass, you mutton-chopped Abraham Lincoln-looking motherfucker. Ha, huh. got some stones on you, son. I like that. What can I do for you? I feel like this guy's face does not match his voice. Thanks for the information. You may have saved my life. No problem. No problem. I really thought that would kill him. Oh! Nasty way to go. Oh, Dad Squad is in full effect. I can't believe you've done this. Boone will be pissed. Boone's a little bee who, with a little pee who follows me no matter what I do because I'm his master. I'm going to play a neutral good character. Goes on to murder a lone ranger hunting down escaped convicts to protect innocence. 
I'd like to speak to you. What I wish to discuss with you can wait for once I get settled in the command room, outsider. Don't ever call me an outsider again in my face unless you want to end up like Boxcar. You got hey, some Mark, Chris Haver some hair. I'm the head paladin of this chapter. And I think we might be able I'm to help each other head out. Head paladin of this chapter and I'm going to need that to TPS to report on my desk by uh, 10 a.m. tomorrow morning sharp. Hey stranger, want to help me overthrow the leader of our resistance effort? Outsiders. Should you refuse, you will be allowed to leave here. Though no, we will be keeping an eye on you. You eyeballing me? Are you willing to help us? Um, yeah, I'll help you. Alright, well, I thought I could tell him that, you know, somebody's trying to end his life, but that's okay. Bald bros don't snitch on semi-bald bros. Oh, hello. They're not gonna be mad. Guaranteed. Commencing attack. Oh! Boone? Tell no one. Tell no one about what has just happened. We're gonna close the door. And we're gonna hack into the terminal control turret. Shoot at registered Brotherhood personnel. I want to see this with my own two eyes. You're mine. Hey! This is the greatest. Oh! <laughs> okay, we should really reload though. What the heck? When did I kill these centaurs? Um. What? What is this? I don't like this. Good start, good start. Beautiful. What is this? You're mine. Alrighty. Job's done. What is this sound? Oh, it's bear. Oh, it's an avalanche. Oh my god. I'm on most extreme elimination challenge. I don't like this guy at all. Um, we know dum dums. You the stupid, not us. We's taken over. Nightkin, sneaky and mean. Stealthy inside my dreams, I think I love you. Make me wanna cry, you make me wanna die. I hate you, 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 Nightkin. Whoa! What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. Fuck this, take out the lair again. Holy crap! Oh my lord. Can't run from me. Ah! Maybe it's my time. Holy crap. It has been done. Charge him with your axe. Holy crap. You alright, buddy? He seems okay. Took you long enough. So can I go now? Is this Danny Trejo? Sorry. I assume the only reason you'd fight past a horde of super mutants and pick the lock on my cell is if you heard my cry for help on the radio. But maybe you're just sightseeing. So since the door's open and all, can I go now? Oh, so we can't take him if we already have Boone. I sure, see. Boss. Well, if we can't have him, nobody can have him. No, I won't do it. Replace Boone? There's no way I'm replacing Boone, man. Boone is my bald bro. I know Raul is bald as well, but you gotta give precedent to the first bald bro. Raul is also bald. Raul is bald and Danny Trejo. Raul! Do you have a gun? What is this? You got like a wrench? No, you got a, a handgun. That's alright. Sure. I'll just pull a toolbox out from behind a conveniently placed rock and get to work. You're a piece of shit, Raul. Why does your shirt say Miguel? Give him a beret so he can at least be undead boon. I swear to God, if you give him Cassandra, I will kill you. Well, that's just... That's out of control, man. Raul! What the heck's going on here? Are these Caesar's Legion? 
Caesar's Legions? You need a lockpick skill of 75 to pick this lock. That's per it's perception that raises it. A nice refreshing battle brew should help. Fancy lads, not that interested. We gotta take one toy car, obviously. Big Book of Science! Oh my god, rocket souvenirs, man. Take all the rockets. So this, this is it from here, but it's pretty good. I'm not gonna complain about it. I'm not gonna take the baseball, that's a Dan Giesling thing. I'm not taking the rockets. In fact, you know what? This might be where I deposit the rockets. Unless, wait, do the rockets have no weight? They have no weight, okay. All the rockets belong to me then. Partnerships. Lock out and pro- I, I forgot that I did four. You're only supposed to do three. My mistake. All right, we'll wait for it to come. You guys, I ruined it. Please! Why are you closed? <laughs> I want to shop. That seems good. Oh, baby, a subscriber. Mercy kill Raul. I'm not going to mercy kill Raul. Not yet, anyway. Well, he died doing what he loved. Isometric exercises at his desk while drinking a delicious caffeinated beverage. Third floor access is for executives only. Please identify. This is bad. Invalid response. This is a real bad day to be you, buddy. Oh, yes! Come to Mick and Ralph's! It can be found at Mick and Ralph's. Alright, you're lucky you're still alive. Happy Bark. Yeah, Raul doesn't wear a hat, exactly. Sweet! To Mick and Ralph's for all your Shut up. I'm so sick of Mick and Ralph. This gun is supposed to be good, it couldn't even kill a child in a single hit. Get ready to be blown up. Nobody can ever possibly blow me up. I had to fight my whole life. I could beat you up even if you had 1,000 knives. Perhaps even if you had infinity knives, I would punch you up into the air like a kite. You're gonna get blown up more than Easy Pete. Well, that's good because Easy Pete is still alive here, so no problem. This looks like a nice place. Let's see what they got inside. There we go. And now it like clicked on Audacity. Um, Raul, you all right, buddy? Won't be long before the Legion and NCR but heads over Hoover Dam. I don't like these warmongers trying to scare up the population. You are the chosen god. You may live, but I am claiming your bed for myself. He was trying to drum up the anxiety and fear of the population, man. That's- he's a- he's a profiteer! Have you seen that tower on the strip all lit up? You can see it for miles. Sure, boy. No I false know. idols! Whoa, 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 okay. It's the Legion again. The Legion does not scare me in the least anymore, even though they may kill me right now. Where is my Rex at? And also, how did you know that I store my heart in my right quad? Have you seen that tower on the strip all lit up? You know what? You get to live this time. Are you hearing these explosions? Wah! At first I thought it was someone calling me on Skype and blowing into the microphone or something like that. That's alright, keep moving. Whoa! Whoa, okay. Um... What happened? Run. You don't have to live like a refugee. Don't have to live like a refugee. Oh my god. I don't have any battle brew, unfortunately. Help. Oh my lord. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa there, pal. You better slow down. How is he talking and smoking at the same like time? The rest of the idiots who thought they'd scavenge in Muma territory. What is okay? Now that I've got your This guy's be hat in has like the narrowest It'll brim I've ever seen. Well it's majestic. Stick to the high cover in the northeast corner of the two buildings, then make a beeline for the gates. He's lying. Mercy kill him. I don't buy it. This is not going well so far. Where are the buildings? Oh, Jesus. They got Raul! 
They've almost made it to the exit. Oh, Jesus Christ. They see those robots on the strip are running around with dis I had to. He has my caps. That guy was so dad squad. Actually, now that I think about it, you're not wrong. But you can't make me feel bad about it. Just jump as the rockets land. I'm done. <laughs> oh, Jesus. They blew off my arm but kept my hand attached. I feel like I'm not safe in here. Apparently we're safe in here. Pretty sweet I keep getting to watch my dog friend get, you know, destroyed here. These buildings are not helping here. There's a there's a building with a roof. That is not a roof. But it does have some steel beams. Oh! Oh, 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 oh! No! Get in! Get in! What? Oh! I thought we made it! I thought we made it! Okay, okay. My limbs are fucked. My limbs are fucked. Oh, it's good! He's in the hidey hole! Okay, it's the perfect place to stand. Also, I... Okay, okay, we're good, we're good! Oh, okay, okay. Exactly as planned. You alright, Rex? How's it going, buddy? Um... Rex? Maybe you could fuck off for a minute? I don't think they're ever gonna get me. I mean, famous last words, yes, but... How the hell did you survive that bombardment? Uh-huh. Simple enough. Run, hide, run. It's all in the timing. But I had you zeroed in the whole time. Nobody's that fast. There's something special about you, child. And it was the howitzers that gave you a chance to show it. I'm very grateful for the opportunity that you gave me there. Hey, uh, we've been waiting for you forever. That's why we shot you with, like, mortars as you came in. We really need to learn to be a little bit less, uh, isolationist. Okay, how about where do I start? Can you show me where the mortars are so that I can disable them? because I hate you, and then I'm gonna mercy kill everyone in this goddamn Air Force Base, and then I'm gonna pick up a vertical takeoff and landing Harrier jet, and I'm gonna fly to a part of the country where this shit doesn't happen, because this is insane. Kill them, don't help them. Give them the old Caesar treatment. Hey. I'm not... Do I have to talk to Pete? I really don't want to listen to this kid tell me the story of his people. Small Pete? They were savages with knives. We blew them up with frag mines and grenades. Burned them with flamethrowers. It was neat, but they were the downside. <laughs> For every 43.6 savages we killed, we lost one of our own. How did you like the mass slaughter, Pete? Here it was neat! And multiplied. Here are mighty guns to destroy any savages who might try to harm us before they can even reach our gates. Well, yeah, but what happens when one gets inside? You little but, bitch. Not saying you want to harm us or you're a savage, but anyways. You best be careful what you Yellis say. has revealed many secrets. It has taught us how to fly the bombers once based here, and it has taught us where to find one. I'm just looking to get a better view here. And that is our story so far. For this last image is our future. Um, you're going to get like a B-52 bomber? I'm pleased that you listened to the entire story. Oh, how sweet would it be if Chris Haversom came back and was like, I found new people! And they're like, you know, Chris, they'll never accept you, man. You're not a boomer, they think you're a savage. And he's like, you're right! Alright, I'll tell you what. We'll put some sugar bombs in the fuel tank and then we would just watch them crash and blow up the whole Air Force Base. Oh, it would be beautiful. I hope knows what she's doing, letting you wander around Nellis as you please. It's been a while since we've seen a good slit tickler in the game, and I gotta agree that this one fits the bill. So you're the outsider. Lived your whole life out there, huh? Wow. I always thought you savages probably spoke a different language. You being from the outside and all, well... I guess you'd call it a personal matter, but... Well... Uh, forget it. Oh, I need to know. Where I come from, we discuss personal matters all the time. Uh, me like personal matters is maybe how you'd expect me to say it, you goddamn racist. That must be nice. Sharing yourself like that. Not being embarrassed or anything. Well, the thing is, there's this girl. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> you'd really talk to her for me? What if she feels the same way? 
What if she comes here like you did? What if she gets blown up? What if she doesn't like me? This oh, guy geez. is going to be too well, easy I to manipulate. Just let you handle it. You look like a really natural body language right now. Really relaxed. Really comfortable. Oh, he's good. Or is he? Raul! Raul, it's time for dinner! Oh, what are we having? Uh, roast beef? Fuck. They handle most of our contact with visitors. No, uh, pardon me. I've walked all across the wasteland to find you, uh, Helen of Troy. I've been inside Nell's. There's a young man there who has a crush on you for some conceivable reason. Nice-looking blonde boy? I always wondered if he was watching me back. What's he like? Uh, he's like Owen Wilson, but with the intelligence of a Vince Vaughn. Oh, I've just got to meet him. Is there any way the boomers would let me visit Nellis? Oh, Lord. Oh, God. Can I do it, chat? Are you going to be mad? Do it, do it, no. Yes, do it, do it. Don't you dare. Do it, do it. Smoke her bitch ass. I'm going to count that as a do it. Really? Thank you so much. I'll get going right away. When the lights go down in the city and the sun shines on the bay who I wanna be back in my city oh 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 doom doom ticka doom doom ticka doom so you think you're lonely well, my friend, I'm lonely too. Wanna get back to my city by the bay? Oh, baby, oh, subscriber! Oh, 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 oh. I can't hit the notes that Steve Perry does after that. But I, I really wanted to keep the song going for this whole like montage of her running here. If Caesar's dead, why ain't the NCR taking? Oh God, Raul! Was that strictly necessary? Kate, I told this girl that a guy here has a crush on her, but she's gonna get shot up with rockets as soon as she runs here. Why would you do that? I don't know. Seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> she disappeared. Quest failed. Oh, I guess she probably. She probably bricked it. Sorry! <laughs> uh, love stinks! I roasted her. So I want to talk to this guy and see what happened. Tell him what you've done? Why do you want to lick his salty tears? You caught me, man. Wrong hanger? Oh, come on. Psych, that's the wrong hanger. Oh, that's true. Look for the one eagerly awaiting the arrival of his only love. Ooh, when you put it that way, I feel sort of bad. Repair Jack's broken heart. That's not even possible, so don't even sweat it. Destroy the panels? Oh, that's, uh, I couldn't possibly, could I? There are spare panels at Helios 1. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm aware. I'm just, I'm, why did that not show up on my map when I looked at it? Maybe it did and I'm stupid? It did and I'm stupid. Okay, back to Helios 1. Yeah, Fantastic was in here. Oh, he still is in many ways. What are the did they dogs respawn in this room? They did respawn. You couldn't just leave well enough alone, could you, NL? Though they were eyeballing the shit out of me. You saw it. Since I was a young man, thousands of I years ago, of raising that we wore an onion on our belt, which was the style at the time. What do you say? Um Sure. How do you expect to raise a bomber from the bottom of the lake? Simple. Attach deployable ballast to the plane and float it on up. Is this Jack's house? Pretty sweet except for the windows. Nellis Women's Barracks. Jack. That is not Jack. Why was it telling me to go in here? I don't feel comfortable with this. Get out. Get out. This is how you end up on a government list somewhere. Nellis Men's. Oh, maybe it was just because it was directly behind it. I see. Maybe it was not telling me to come in here either? What the heck, man? This architecture is too uniform. Oh, there we go. No, nope. Those are not Jack, in case you're curious. Jack? Not Jack? He has no sense of direction. This is very true. Um, I'll give you that. And now look at your map, please. Thank you, Spyro. You keep me in line. I appreciate it. 
The boomers are dicks, so are the Brotherhood of Steel, but at least they didn't try to murder you when you came in. This is exactly my logic. You're following me. See, I, I use the tit-for-tat strategy. If you shoot me on the way in, I'm gonna find a way to undermine you. Uh, but, uh, if you're nice to me on the way in, then that's no problem. The Brotherhood didn't try to blow you up, they just put an explosive slave collar on you. Well, if you want to get into, you know, splitting hairs, okay. Why the fuck did you kill Mr. House then? Mr. House was being a little jerk hole, so I murdered him to preserve autonomy in the Mojave. Mr. House was a big B with a little P, exactly true. Oh, it's fucking Mr. Desk again. Found the missing patrols, or was something else on your mind? For example, would you like me to tell you the story of how I built this impressive U-shaped desk? It's been a great boon to my productivity. Why is every YouTuber terrible at directions? The truth of the matter is that everybody's terrible at directions, but it doesn't get any better when you got, uh, you know, people on your butt about it. That's just the truth, man. If NL weren't in the dad squad, he could just ask for directions. That's true, real dads don't ask for directions. I've been observing the penal facility there in the distance for some time now. <laughs> after having followed some other You kiss your mother with that mouth? You never shut up. He's not wearing a hat, okay? What do you think you're doing? <laughs> that voice actor really sold it there. What do you think you're doing? You speak truthfully, for it is unlikely someone would know both the name of the elder and the catchphrase that he uses. What do you think you're doing? He's clearly anxious, mercy kill him. Don't tempt me. What do you think you're doing? Number five? Are you kidding me? What do you think you're doing? I am! Uh, my Pete Weber was a little weak there. Do Michael Caine saying, what do you think you're doing, Master Wayne? Indict. 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 What do you think? Master Wayne. <laughs> Master Wayne. Master. Indict. Master Wayne. What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing? Obsession is a young man's game. Where are you going, dog? I thought you was keeping it gangster. I thought that's what you wanted. You all right, man? He seems scared. Don't worry. Thornforge can make that all go away. Caesar's Legion infamy gained. Look, I'm not gonna feel bad about killing a dude who is like a literal assassin sent to kill me. Do Michael Caine performing Illmatic? In indict. Rappers be monkey flipping with the funky rhythm I'll be kicking. I can't really, I can't do it. Do Frank Underwood as Bruce Wayne's other butler. Now, Master Wayne, I do declare. Would you like a refreshment? I will have Claire fix something up. Forthwith. <laughs> Angle bracket bark scorpion. That's pretty clever. I hope you get the credit you deserve. Oh, it's fucking moth country. You. Young Cazador. It's such a good name. This is for Cheyenne, you little dicks. Yo, that <laughs> that young gecko was straight fire, man. Do Bill Clinton apologizing to the nation for sexual relations? That's like very, very slightly before my time. I did not have sexual relations. I don't know, that's more of like, I don't know if that's Ross Perot or George Bush Elder, Scrolls Five Skyrim. Never do Bill Clinton again. Do Bill Clinton saying, get me a ginger beer? Get me a ginger beer. Do Michael Caine that apologizing for sexual relations? Instead, in two date, sides have reached in date I did have and only occasionally sexual relations <laughs> with that, if I didn't with know that. Better. I'd Young lady, side is confident enough to push for a full victory. I'm very sorry, Which Master White. I've let you and the nation damage. down. In any event, indeed, I've recorded my findings in this report. Please Got me a ginger beer. Elder. Do Tommy Wiseau asking for a ginger beer from Bruce Wayne? <laughs> oh, hi, Bruce. Yeah, I'll take a ginger beer, please. <laughs> Give me a ginger beer. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Slicing up eyeballs, oh ho ho ho, yeah exactly. Tommy's so groovy, oh ho ho ho, it's Tommy Wiseau singing the baser side one, track one from Doolittle. Or did you have something to discuss? The um, takes a little getting used to, doesn't it? You are the final boss of Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Vaults freak me out. How will NL navigate those fucking vaults? Go to the vaults. That guy looks like Boone. He's a bald bro. 
He was bald bro-ish. You will never navigate the vault? You will never navigate this! As soon as I pick up some caps that Daughtry owes me, I'm out of Daughtry? the Daughtry?! Yard. American Idol?! Ryan remembers Daughtry. He truly is the best pop culture trivia man. I remember all of my bald brothers. Patrolling the Mojave almost oh, makes you yeah, I bet it does. Winter. One of the range of vets looked... <laughs> Name that first is one hell yes, of like a fucking Otto that. von Bismarck mustache. Patrolling the Mojave sort of I'll makes... No? Okay. Daughtry glitches out sometimes and doesn't show up. That's just because he's too busy coming in third on the fourth season of American Idol. This is the dopest we've ever looked. Without a doubt. Chris Daughtry is a bald bro? I'm aware. He's got a little slit tickler as well. So, oh, Daughtry! If it's bad news, you can take it up with the colonel. If it's good news, it better involve some dead fiends. A pleasure to meet you. A I'm pleasure Dr. to meet Thomas you. Thomas Hildern, Director of Operations, OSI East. I presume you're here about Vault 22? Oh, Sunset Sarsaparilla Factory. My healing item needs have finally been taken care of. This place is a goddamn jackpot. Now that we have it on the map, we can get it next time. Oh, don't crash on me, game. Don't don't crash on me. I think it's going to I think it's crashed on me. No, nobody spoiled the plant vaults. People told me it was very scary, though, so I am, I'm scared. You know, I, I feel like Fallout is it's becoming, like, an illuminating experience for me. It's illuminating, like, all these fears that I didn't know I had. And while I like eating vegetables, I'm actually, like... You scared me a little bit there. I'm actually, like, sort of scared of plant people. Like, Invasion of the Body Snatchers fucked me up forever, wow. man. Do a Donald Sutherland impression? Donald Sutherland is literally 86 years old. There is no way I can do a good Donald Sutherland impression, but because I love you, I will try. It would be like, The girl on fire. <laughs> That's really bad. This crowd's walking as hell on my back, boss. That was kind of a pretty good uh, Danny, or Danny Trejo impression there, Raul. I guess it would be more like, um, wow. I warned you, Katniss. Anything that could have happened has happened. I don't know. Donald Sutherland is a very careful cadence. That is very true. I wouldn't even call it careful. I would call it very considered. He has the cadence of a man who has said a lot in his life and now um, doesn't need to talk all the time to feel, uh, you know, like he's doing the right thing. Do Michael Caine doing Donald Sutherland. This is going to be... Oh, okay. This is going to be near impossible. Um, that would be more like... And die, Marshall Wayne. I mean, that's just me calibrating, getting into the zone. Uh, I'm Donald. I'm Donald Sutherland. <laughs> this is so bad. You may remember me from the invasion of the Body Snatchers. I was also in uh, Space Cowboys. And indeed, I'm President Snow in the Hunger Games. Do Michael Caine. As Frank Underwood asking for a PS Vita for his car? Is that a uh, PlayStation Vita? <laughs> Indeed. Indeed it is a PS Vita. And I want one of those for my car. For my lorry. Thank you as well. As well. Whoa! Oh, it's a Son of Caesar Legion! How could they be looking for me when I haven't even found myself? I was trying to find myself, but I didn't know I was lost. But I actually, like, totally knew I was lost. And now, any advice for someone starting college in a week? Yeah, like, not even in, like, a jokey Michael Caine voice. Go to class is a big one. I would recommend that. And now, I'm getting a theoretical degree in physics. Well, you can get a great job, uh... Working in uh, Helios 1, man. I heard it's recently come back online. I'm scared. This is my first vault in Fallout history. Raul, could you freaking move? We got an elevator. We got stairs. And we got the lab. Why well, take the elevator when there's a perfectly good set of stairs, baby? Okay, but seriously. I don't I don't do that well with jump scares. Oh, oh, they're moths. Okay. Ah, no big deal. We we fought them before. I hear I hear the chittering. It might just be Rex though. Now that- this is what video games do, okay? They freaking 
They go, oh, I don't know. There might, there's something in the hallways. And you're like, I haven't seen anything in the hallways. And then as soon as you've hit that trigger, when you walk out, a big fucking mantis just goes, Rrr! and you go, oh, okay, good foreshadowing. So I'm scared. Could maintenance look into the ductwork? Oh, my God. The, uh, not in the air ducts. You're just introducing, like, too many monsters at the same time here. I can't be scared of all of them at once, but I'm going to try. That's fucking gross. Let's take the stairs. Why well, take the stairs when there's a perfectly good other set of stairs? I didn't even look at what this is. Production what? Production what? Pro what is this production of? Food production? What if I am the food? That elevator sounds like... Oh! Oh! Oh, what the... F Pardon me? Pardon me? There is a fucking plant-human hybrid. Inside of the... Of the... Soil? At least we roasted the shit out of him. I don't like purple light. Freaks me out. How do you feel about purple haze? Excuse me. Let's say indict. Excuse me while I kiss this guy. And then she shot on a turtle. Do you see all these red things on my map? Uh, it's a little scary. Oh, Rex, you scared me. I thought there was some kind of plant dog. I'm so scared. I I can't carry on a conversation. That's the thing. I'm always like, oh, I'm not gonna do. I hate. Okay, I guess oh, oh, right. Oh, thank you. I think you smoked them already. I always say I don't want to do horror games because, like, oh, you know, I'm not one of those fake let's players. But really, I just get scared. <laughs> well. Oh, oh, oh! I walked right by him. He touched me. Raul, what is going on? Where's Raul? Raul! Raul is one of them now. Where's Rex? They don't know where the hell they're going down here, man. Raul left to reunite with his brother, and yeah, I think he's a plant ghoul in disguise, man. I have no idea where I am, but I've been there many times. We've been in here. This is where we just were. We mercy killed that dude. We were in here. We read the... Oh, my God. Hello? Hello? Why are you closed? I want to shop! Ladies and gentlemen. Well, let's do things the right way the first time. Whoa. Okay. We're fine. Dude, there's fucking plants in this one. Sorry, boss. Oh, Raul, you scared the shit out of me. When he said sorry, boss, I thought there was like a plant ghost Raul. <gasps> ah! Ah! Oh my god. 74 experience. Did I at least get a level for being terrified? Raul pulled his wrench out, so he sort of spoiled the surprise for me a little bit, but still. I want him to open a stall door and Raul will be in there. After numerous attempts, I found a range that highlights the particles in the air that I believe killed everyone in this vault. Preliminary tests show them to be spores of some kind. At this point, I'm concerned the plants may constitute a danger to the people of NCR. Alright. Luckily, I've got a gas mask on in the form of my green mustache to uh, filter out all the harmful particles. Okay, crew quarters. Ah, okay. Sorry, I didn't realize this was your home. My mistake. Oh, we got a key card. I found a key card. Well, now I just I feel pretty bad, but I've already murdered like, you know, one of the members of the family. Should probably just like go through with it. Finish the fight, you know? Pardon me? Oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. Do Michael Caine doing NL? Wouldn't that just be like, um... Indict on playing the Binding of Isaac Rebirth again? It's no problem. Drop the battle brew, you scumlord. I can quit whenever the fuck I want, and don't you forget it. Oh my god. Raul? You look awesome. I am not fucking with you. You are 
goddamn the sexiest ghoul I've ever seen. And I have seen literally four of them. Give him a lightsaber? Give him a spacesuit? I should give him the spacesuit helmet. Alright. Alright, I'll give you the space helmet, Raul. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable. Raul, can you stop being such a fucking sarcastic little bitch? Do you know the lengths that I went through to get this suit? This suit is my daughter, man. Do Michael Caine doing a Jamaican accent. I will I will not do this. How do you feel about Raul being inside of your sentient stealth suit? That's Raul's prerogative, man. If he wants to, he he can do it. Get ready. Get ready. Ah! Okay, we'll go down this way. Oh! 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 Oh, God! Oh, the game freaked out when I stepped on it. And, oh, oh, my body is, uh... My body is a wonderland. Oh, God. Do Michael Caine stuck in a well. Is there anybody up yet? I, uh, appear to have fallen down. Some kind of water-carrying vessel. A well. In the common parlance of all times. Ah! Oh! Okay, no, no. <laughs> no problem. I, uh, wasn't at all scared. It was really just that, uh, did that new attack that I've never seen. Just, uh, just a little scared. <gasps> Fucking, oh god, walk back, walk back. Ooh. <laughs> Woo. These caves just never end. We're just getting fat experience here. Just a slow motion of Raul walking towards me. I guess Rex is going buck wild on some... Plant creatures up there. What in the fucking earth is this? Wah! No. I don't want to be here. I, I don't want to be here at all. The data is mostly uncorrupted. Here then, as promised. Yo, for real though, you really shouldn't grow these plants, man. Did you see the part about the fungus that spreads itself and, you know, makes a fucking zombie, like, army in here? I've done more than my part, you owe me more caps. Amongst civilized people, one doesn't just demand more than one is agreed to. Alright, I'll sell this data to a more interested party. Here, take these caps. That's all of my contracting budget, and it's yours. Alright, now, now that he's given us all the caps, let's murder him. No, like, I really need you to not use this data. Okay, so we've saved, we're gonna crouch, we're gonna take out the axe, and we're gonna cut his head off, then we're gonna put the axe away, and we're gonna walk out. All right. Let's never speak of this again. Where, oh where is my Vault 11? Oh where, oh where has my Vault 11 gone? Oh where, oh where can it be? Are there giant plant monsters that want to kill me? Oh where, oh where can it be? Don't, you're gonna hurt, he's like, well, I'm gonna crouch lock boss, unless my creaky old knees give us away. By the way, here's me doing like a 30 foot leap off of a boulder. And now, what do you suggest for chat wanting dad squad back? Fucking Raul is like 500 years old, he's the ultimate dad. Raul is not a dad. Without a doubt, Raul is infertile as fuck. Yo, you can be infertile and still have been a dad in the past. Four corpses at the front entrance of Vault 11 and a strange recording point of sinister events. Determine what happened to the citizens of Vault 11. Nate Stone should be overseer, not me. Oh, nobody wants to be overseer. I see. Effective immediately, the traditional selection pro process for overseer is hereby ended. In lieu of a yearly election, a citizen will be chosen one month prior to the start of his or her term with our mainframe's random number generator ensuring complete impartiality and fairness. Interesting. Very interesting what's happening here. People don't want to be the overseer. What could be the... What's, what's the problem with becoming the overseer? Who knows? We're about to find out. Maybe you get eaten by fucking moths non-stop, man. There hasn't been a coffee delivery in 40 fucking years! Oh, thanks, Raul. I really appreciate it. There must be something half-decent in here. Otherwise, you know, why would we open the door into the fucking moth paradise? Oh! What the hell?! Yo, Geek Squad! That's not cool, man. She's got the authority. Nothing says she can't. 
can't change the selection process for future overseers. I say she can't. Maybe march into her office with torches and pitchforks? Yes. He said my husband's name had come up in their meetings. The candidate endorsement meetings? Yes, they were going to endorse him. He wouldn't say why, but I know my husband had a reg regular poker game with some of them, and he'd been on a winning streak lately. And according to you, what did Mr. Gottlieb offer? He said he could sway his block, prevent the endorsement, but if and only if I performed sexual favors. Was this just for Mr. Gottlieb? No, all the block leadership and their friends. And you agreed? What else could I do? They had a majority. How long did this go on before the endorsements came out? I don't know. A month, maybe. And when they came out and your husband was endorsed despite your supposed agreement, well, was that when you decided to kill members of the block? Yes, I thought their majority is pretty slim. If I thin things out, especially in the leadership, someone else might get elected. Assuming you weren't caught. No, Mr. Miles. No, Mr. Miles. I expected to be caught. That was my best chance. Now they'll elect me. A confessed murderer? You think voters will be willing to risk putting you in charge? They have to pick somebody and live with their reasons. Yes, but wait and see. Ooh, things are getting interesting down here in Vault 11. Everything... Pardon me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Water's bad. Water's bad. Do I have to go into the water? I don't want to go into the water. <gasps> oh, Rex, you scared the ever-living fuck out of me. I don't want to go into the water. Why would I want to go into the water? I think I have to go into the water. This is fucking Jellyfish Vault? You want to believe that somewhere in the archives there's an answer to all of this, or perhaps there will be when, one, when the historical records are complete and the whole story is told. We want it to make sense. To understand why the vault's mainframe will kill us if we do not offer one of our own as a yearly sacrifice. To fully comprehend why we continue to have these elections, despite the unfettered corruption that has plagued it for what must be decades by now. Well, I've been through the archives and I can tell you you won't find the answer there. You'll find an account of the first overseer, who entered the vault as the only citizen aware of the sacrifices that would have to take place, but he didn't have the answers either. If he did, surely he would have foreseen the citizen's anger when he broke the news. Surely he would have guessed that they would want to choose a sacrifice democratically in the way that we citizens are accustomed to washing our hands of terrible deeds, and that his name would be at the top of the polls, and that simultaneous vacancy of overseer and martyr would forever Fuse the two positions here in Vault 11. Help! I'm freaking drowning, dog! I freaking drowned! A nice battle brew would really help you out right now. <laughs> Don't tempt me. Open sacrificial chamber. Oh, fuck. Is this what the brother is, like, hiding in that sweet-ass U-shaped desk he's got? Welcome. Please sit in the chair. The show is about to begin. Okay. Raul is a good dude for following you, following you down here. Absolutely true. Hey, Rex. I love you, buddy. Let's take a moment to reflect on the moments that made your life. What is this? Getting a massage? You kissed your steady girl for the first time under the bleachers at the big game. Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. Helios 1 coming back online. Jason Bright and his followers launching into the vast unknown. Helios 1 coming back online. And who could forget Who could forget that time? Jeannie Mae Crawford sold your wife into slavery with the Caesar's Legion while carrying your unborn child in her stomach. Think of these things. Good. What you are feeling You've led a great life. Living it has been its own reward. But it is only the beginning. Close your eyes now. And imagine what joys await you in the next life. The afterlife. Can you see them? Good. I want to come back as Rex. Um. What's going on? Oh! 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 We can do this! We can fight him off! Fuck you! You're not taking me, buddy! Now put the movie back on! I wanna know how it ended! Congratulations, citizens of Vault 11. You have made the decision not to sacrifice one of your own. Despite what you were led to believe, the population of Vault 11 is not going to be exterminated for its disobedience. You are precisely correct, chat. These motherfuckers got Shyamalan. Alright, I know you can hear me, so listen up. We're not gonna send anybody to die anymore. 
So shut off our water, our gases, or do whatever it is you're programmed to do. But we're done listening to you. Oh, hell yeah. Easy Pete, I knew it. Go kill Easy Pete for retribution. Were you listening, man? Easy Pete uh, was one of the dudes who saved the day. Real sorry about this. Real sorry about this. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Ooh, goodbye, Raul. Oh, hey, what's up, guys? This is awkward. Okay, I guess we're doing this. Oh, it's Caesar's Legion! <laughs> this is like some uh, Jerry Lawler shit, man. My god, that's Caesar's Legion's music! You have discovered El Dorado Dry Lake. Is this golf club? Oh my, what? Rex hunted him down! He was like 12 kilometers away. Rex doesn't give a shit. Fuck, Mary kill Raul, Boone, and Rex. Uh. Uh. Huh. I would kill Raul because he's lived a long life. Uh, Raul's lived for like 500 years, so you know, he's had enough time. Um, I would fuck Boone, not because I find him attractive necessarily, but because I don't want to spend the rest of my life listening to him bitch and moan, and I would marry Rex because he's a badass dog. What is that? You're airing out your, your genitalia. Excuse me? You were doing the, the requisite dance move for big balls. I did not. I did not. I did not, I did not murder him. The bigger the cushion, the sweeter the pushing. That's what I said. The looser the waistband, the deeper the quicksand. Oh, so I have read. What the fuck are you doing here? <laughs> oh my god. Kind of fucking death wish, asshole. <laughs> oh my god. Freaking relax, lady. What the fuck are you doing here? You fucking dick munching cock sucking ass clown! Don't shoot at him. You're so lucky that there's one more person here, or I would cut your head off in fucking two seconds. Look at you've even got a strap that's like the perfect line to plan my decapitative force. Don't you fucking eyeballing me? I can still do it. No mercy, just end her bloodline. Your pet ghoul smells like ass. I don't have you talking about fucking Raul? I left him outside. Your pet ghoul smells like ass. Yo, Raul's outside, man. So you are either very right or very wrong. Like I give a shit. But the I, or is it like, like give a shit? I don't know, man. This is, this is a wild area. None of this is stealing because fiends aren't people. Wow, that's rude. Are you fucking denigrating my species, you fucking ass muncher? And now, please do Frank Underwood as Pete Weber. That's right. Wow. <laughs> Bald Egda, thank you very much for the subscription. That's right, I did it. Who do you think you are? I am. Claire and I, number five, are you kidding me? As the senatorial whip of this institution. God damn it, right. Oh, she OD'd. That's, that's sad. <sighs> two weeks later, she was found in the vault of the ghouls with a needle in her arm. Fiend, two months due. Sasha Thumper. So I'm that now. Better go search vault three. Oh! Mercy revive her. Your pet ghoul smells like Shut ass. the fuck up about Raul. Your pet ghoul smells Shut like ass. Shut up forever. Your pet ghoul smells like ass. That must have been a fun day in the recording booth. The dream is real. Ah! Sleep! I'm dead as hell. I am dead as hell. Good night, sweet prince. Oh, there was a freaking bubble down there? Okay, we're going back. Nailed it. Bubble. Where's the bubble? There's no bubble, you, you savages! There's no bubble! There's no bubble! I drowned in here! Why would you trust chat? Valid. Haven't been this way yet. Alright, this could be the way. Oh, okay. That explains it. Yep. Yeah. Just inject that shit straight into your leg. You'll be fine. Alright. What is... It's just non-stop 
fucking explosions. If you go out in the woods today, you're in for a big surprise. Ah, we made it! What? It's like some NCR ranger in here. How the hell did you get in here? What the hell will you have for dinner? Open access panel. There's a freaking fiend back here! Bryce! House all dead, we should hit the st Get the fuck out of here! What is happening? Why are they not aggroed? Get the fuck out of here! Like, give a shit. Um. You like the sight of your own blood? I didn't really want to do this, but kind of left me like no choice. So, is this slow mo just gonna last forever, huh? You like the sight of your own blood? Is that? I think our buddy is dead. What's up, guys? You cool? We're cool, right? I don't like the sight of my own blood, okay? We cool? You see a ranger in black run the other way. Take you out from a quarter I do not like the sight of my own blood. I thought we'd covered this. House all dead, we should hit the strip. Rip shit up. Oh, what's up, dog? I wasn't expecting a resupply so soon. I am going to murder you. You can't hide from me. Like, this is just 100%. You ready to die? Like the sight of your... Like the sight of your own blood? Oh, I basically don't know what's happening. But I did murder... Like the sight of Motor your Runner? Damn, that's gonna leave a stain. That's gonna leave a stain. What in the Sam Hill is even going on right now? I have no idea. I don't have any battle brew, you savages. Okay? Reverse pulse cleaner. We did the Brotherhood quest! We can leave. He tried. You've gained karma! Oh my god. Would you fuck me? This is the beer goggles wearing off. I'd fuck me. How's it going? So long as the cons keep making it, I keep getting high. You are high as hell, man. You lost your fucking mind. No! You like the sight of your own blood? I don't know what is going on down here anymore. Dad, why are you there? Okay, don't call me dad. It's freaking me out a little. Leave them in jail, NL? Hell no. These guys are my brothers. You like the sight of your own blood? Yep. Called it. Mercy killed them all. Well, that's pretty much like how it's going right now. Watch out. You like the sight of your own blood? Uh, I'm starting to question whether or not I like the sight of my own blood. All right, what's up, dogs? How's it going? You might be locked in here for a little while longer if my lockpicking skill is any indication. Rachel! All right. Well, we've cleared out this vault. Problem solved. Wow? What do you mean, wow? You got a problem? This is the worst graffiti I've ever seen in a video game. Duh. You like the sight of your own duh. That's also pretty good. One more? I do not care at all about the sight of my own blood. Your pet ghoul smells like duh. I like it. Alright. Oh, a fucking straight up Nuka Cola. Nuka Cola. Nuka Cola. Nuka Cola. Nuka Cola. Nuka Cola! Your pet ghoul smells like the sight of your own blood. Oh, what's up, dogs? Prim is gonna be much tougher to push around with that new sheriff down there. She's like, what are you doing? What are you do I told you I would decapitate you right along the neckline. It's the new YouTube rating system. Like and give a shit. Where's Rex? Rex? 
How much is that doggy in the window? Woof, woof. The one with the waggly tail. Oh, there he is. We found him. How much is that doggy in the window? Woof, woof. I sure hope that doggy's for sale. Do you like the sight of your own dad? What happened to overthrowing the elder? I don't trust that other dude. I only know one thing about the other dude. And it is like, he exclusively wants to murder things. So, I'm not too thrilled about that. I swear to God, if this dude uses all these fucking components to just make like an O-shaped desk instead of the U-shaped desk, I'm gonna be so fucking mad. The other dude is a bald bro? That's true. People called me a hero after what happened at Helios. Me too. What can I do for you? Um, I'd like, I'd like to join the Brotherhood. Exceptional individuals like yourself are sometimes allowed to join the Brotherhood if they perform a valuable service for Are you fucking kidding me? Both your actions up to this point have been commendable. I am afraid they don't quite qualify as such a Are service. you fucking kidding me? However, I do have another task that fits the bill rather nicely. Would you consider undertaking it? Hey, uh, thanks for saving my people, but, you know, everybody who's in the Brotherhood has done more than that. Are you fucking... Kate says, you should ask him if he likes to see the sight of his own blood. Assuming they're still operational. You like the sight of your own brother? To operate on the surface again. Only a few quests left and then you will be a true brother. First, get on your knees and suck on my nuts. Mmm, yes. Everyone in the Brotherhood had to go through this. And it turns out fucking Elder McNamara is not even the Elder, he's just some old pervert who got to sit in that desk. Yo, if you got a U-shaped desk, nobody questions you, man. Alright, I got your fucking groceries, as instructed. Yes, we've already started receiving telemetry from it. You're a member of the Brotherhood now. And your gear- Of course, you're only a junior member of the Brotherhood. Uh, I'm gonna need you to go get my oil changed. Everyone has to change my oil before they become a senior paladin. Oh, Jesus Christ! Beep boop. I'm a Star Wars character, beep boop. Dad Trooper? Yeah, this is like dads getting together for the Star Wars convention. I'm not gonna boxcar McNamara. He just made me his true fucking bro for life. Talk to Jack about getting a rebreather to swim to the bottom of Lake Mead. Do you remember what you did to Jack? Oh. Oh. He's doing the classic. I'm gonna rip you in it, Zach. I'm upset. Your hole. Leg thing. You alright, buddy? Hey there. Back for more? He actually does not seem that upset right now. Mercy kill him so he can be with the one true love. Oh my god, you guys are... Rude dudes who are also full of some great ideas. I may come back there at a later date. I'm gonna add him to my shit list. Owen Wilson and Easy Pete. These are the two people on my shit list. We are fucking Immortan Joe from Mad Max. Easy Pete will blow your ass up with dynamite? Easy Pete is a little bee with a little pee. Whoa! Amazing. It's going to be a dream come true once you've raised that bomber from Lake Mead. I could leave my spare change in the wrinkles on your forehead, my man. That's tremendous. Hello, friend. How can Mother Pearl be of help today? Don't patronize me, you... Lazy piece of garbage. I've done everything for your community. You try to murder me, I get in, and I save the day. I raise your stupid B-29 from the bottom of the ocean. You're, how can Mother Pearl help you today? Maybe don't give me a chore. What you have done for us is a miracle, child. People want me to do dead money. Do dead money so we can see you cry. Is dead money not really hard? Dead money, dead money, dead money, dead money, dead money, dead money. Okay. People want me to see dead money. Dead money is very hard. Don't do it. You're going to be lost forever. It's happening. Dot gif. Oh, I don't, I don't necessarily like the idea that I'll be lost forever. That's why I've got you guys to rely on. Oh, it's Caesar's Legion! Caesar's Legion is... Oh, my lord. My favorite part of this run right now. They always just show up at, like, the least opportune times. And they're like, hey, remember how you killed our leader? You're done! Come on. You'll never work in this town again, but then we work in this town.